Is there any foods that you can't eat because of texture, Laura? Oh, wait, you, how long do you have? Well, it might be that. <laughs> how long us. do you have? <laughs> but if, it, if it gets past like 45 minutes with this list, then can I just cut it all out? <laughs> so baked beans, I have a like my, I have a really, really extreme reaction to baked beans. Um, I remember very distinctly at four years old, sitting in my kitchen, being given baked beans. And I think I tasted them, didn't like them, looked at them and convinced myself that they were aliens. Six and a half hours later. I, I have such a strong reaction to baked beans that when I was a student at university and worked in hospitality, I could never work on the breakfast shift because I can't pick up a plate that someone had baked, that had baked beans on it and then take it into the kitchen to clear. In like staff rooms at work, if people have baked beans for their lunch, I have to leave the staff room. I can't look directly at them. Any months later. They've never been in my house. My, my son, I don't think, has ever had them. And if he has, they would be somewhere else. So <laughs> baked beans, um, very, very strong reaction to. However, spaghetti hoops, totally fine. Tomato ketchup as well, that's another absolute no-no. Just the look of it makes me, uh, even just thinking about it, uh, that's um, just not at all. One eternity later. The other one would really be bananas. I don't mind banana flavour, like so bana when people have made banana loaf, I don't mind the flavour of them of the banana through it, but just the, the look of the banana, the te um, how it feels in your hand, the texture, I, ha I mean I haven't had it since I was a child, but the texture of it just I find very unsettling. And similarly, avocados, I like guacamole, I don't mind avocado taste, but actual avocado itself, just the texture of it is really... Kind of, uh, I'm yeah. actually really similar. 